Yo, yo, yo. What? What's up, guys? We're really excited to talk to you guys. First time we're talking, right? This is the first time we in this biatch. We litty, we litty. Okay, so basically, um, I'm reading this book right now, Thinking Grow Rich. And I, it made me want to make a video because I talked to a lot of people who are starting Shopify and dropshipping and shit. And, like, everybody who's doing it, anybody who, anybody could do dropshipping or Shopify. It's not fucking rock and science. Look at me. Like, people, I was known for being, like, talked down to and, like, being a dumbass in high school and shit. And now it's, like, but... That's just another story. But basically what I'm trying to say is like this book was talking about uh, desire and taking action. And it made me realize that like the reason that I had success at the beginning and it was working well from the start is because my desire was so fucking high up there it was, that it was like I needed to make it. it. I was going to make it. I didn't need to make it. I, was, I, was, I just knew it was going to happen. Like, I had no hesitation that it wasn't going to happen because I saw everybody else doing it. So I was, like, online. I didn't even know anybody personally at first. But, like, online, I just saw people doing it. So I'm like, fuck, why can't I do it? And I was learning so much self-development before, so I was already prepared. I was ready. I was ready for it. I was ready for the fucking fire. So I wasn't, I wasn't willing to give up, you know? So, yeah, like... And I'm saying this also to myself, too, because I went to Miami, and ever since I came back, I still kind of been on that party mode, that party vibe, you know? Just not being as much, like, but, yeah, just not being as much as, like, uh, consistent and stuff like that. So, yeah, and now I'm just trying to get back into the mode, make some videos, help the world, change the world. That's the goal, you know. That's the goal for everybody, hopefully. But, yeah, one person at a time. But, yeah, and also it talks about, like, just taking action. Like, if you're a newbie and you're watching this shit, take action right now. Stop watching this video. Just go, and because you know what to do, unless you actually don't. But if you've watched, like, a shitload of videos and you haven't done anything, you know who you are. You know who you are. Just fucking go. Like, don't be a weirdo and just waste your time watching videos without acting. Like, that's just stupid. Just stop if you're doing that. Might as well just stop wasting your time. Go and waste your time doing other shit. Like, because that's just stupid. So, yeah. Take action and also for me you know like because to be honest i've been making wanting to make videos for the longest fucking time for so long but i've been putting it off i've been like oh i just been thinking too much i've just been putting excuses like oh i don't know how to do this i don't know how to do that but nah you just do it and then you learn from your mistakes that's how it works that's how life works but just make sure your mistake doesn't kill yourself. It's not bad enough that it kills you. Because <laughs> you can learn from your mistakes, but it's better to learn from other people's mistakes. It's good to learn from your mistakes, but they might fuck you over so badly that you die or you're just fucking back to square one. And you obviously don't want that. That would suck. Especially if you have a lot. But anyways, so yeah, I just wanted to give that little fucking talk, and I'm going to be making more talks like this. Like, my goal is to just build up some videos and just, I want to help people. Like, that's really what I want to do. Like, now, to be honest with you guys, dropshipping and Shopify or whatever, it's not, it's not motivating to just make money. Now I'm just trying to do other shit, like just help people give value to the world. Because one thing that I was, uh, Ty Lopez, like I know a lot of people fucking hate him, but he's my idol, so, uh, yeah. 
And basically, like, he was saying that there's three levels, there's three types of businesses. The first business is, like, a business. It's a win-lose business where basically you you win and they lose. Like, for example, McDonald's or cigarettes. Like, you get money if you're, or, like, the owner but they lose, like, you're giving them, you're giving them, like, something that's going to end up killing them long term, you know, so, and the second type of business is, a like, a neutral business, a business that's, like, gives you, you give them, they give you money, and you give them something back, and it's basically, it's, like, equal, you know, like, for example, uh, hospital, I mean, yeah, I guess maybe the hospital, no, no, maybe, a better example is the hotel, it's like hotels, fucking, uh, I guess hospital, maybe. But yeah, basically, like, no, hospital, it's more because you're just, you could be saving somebody's life or something. But basically, like, stuff like that. Like a, a, a restaurant or something. You're not doing much, you're just, there. you're, it's equal value, you know? It's not too crazy. And then a third level is, like, those huge-ass businesses that actually change people's lives in a good way, like Facebook or Google or f- any of those, you know, you name it, Instagram, like, Tesla. Those are, like, those are fucking huge-ass type 3 businesses because they're changing the world. They changed, they revolutionized something in the world, you know? Like, for example, Facebook revolutionized talking to people online and just in be having personal relationships online, et cetera, et cetera. So, yeah, I'm ranting a bit too much, but yeah. So, yeah, man, just fucking get to it, and I'm about to go out. Peace.